Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Lozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. The biceps femoris muscle has two heads, a long head and a short head. The biceps femoris muscle is part of the hamstrings muscle group. It is located on the lateral aspect of the posterior thigh. The origin of the long head of the biceps femoris is the ischial tuberosity. The insertion is on the head of the fibula. The innervation is the tibial nerve, which is a branch of the sciatic nerve from vertebral levels L5, S1, and S2. The concentric actions of the biceps femoris long head are hip extension, knee flexion, and lateral rotation of the tibia when the knee is flexed. The origin of the short head of the biceps femoris is the linea aspera of the femur. It joins with the long head and inserts into the head of the fibula. The innervation is the common fibular nerve, which is a branch of the sciatic nerve from vertebral levels L4, L5, S1, and S2. And the concentric actions are knee flexion and lateral rotation of the tibia when the knee is flexed. The biceps femoris long head crosses two joints. It crosses the hip joint and the knee joint, while the short head of the biceps femoris only crosses one joint, which is the knee joint. So again, the origin of the biceps femoris long head is on the ischial tuberosity, while the origin of the short head of the biceps femoris is on the linea aspera of the femur.